na hali iko namna hii kama kila wakati moto ingekuwa maji yapatikana ingekuwa baba ni maendeleo ingepatikana hiki anja hii tungemaliza sehemu moja kabisa lakini ukosevu hii maji into nanipa sisi e, tunabanda hata sasa hii wena kutaki tule sisi tunabanda hii kawa kidogo hii ni robo hata nusu nusu deka nusu deka hii sasa hii iko iko ndani hapa nusu deka peke yake sasa ndio hiyo shida yetu ile iko hapa lakini wakati Mwenyezi Mungu anajalia sisi bangine hata mabadiliko naweza tokea mabadiliko naweza tokea eh hata nasikia eh, saa hii naona mtu anakuja mtu kidogo anakuja saa hii inakuja saa hii eh hey, naona watoto nasema namna hiyo hiyo ni yote ni baraka ya Mungu eh yeah. yeah, sasa kama mtu anakuja roho yetu nafurahia kabisa yeah. lakini kama nakosekana hiyo maji eh baba hii iko shida kubwa sana eh yeah, lazima uangalie watu ile huko sehemu bali natoka hiyo maji abatikane ni ni mzuri eh yeah. yeah. One of the feedback that we got from our community dialogues is that we, we need to engage more uh, other, other stakeholders like the flower, farm, the flower farms along Nanyuki, Timau, Rumuruti bec uh, and because these farms are using also a lot of pesticides and uh, we need to engage them in our work, in our advocacy and sit together with them, work together with them so that they can also see the effects of the pesticides that are being used and also so that they can come and see because Ewasonyiro depends on so many tributaries some of the tributaries are blocked along the flower farms so they need to come down here and see how this is affecting communities downstream and also midstream and upstream yeah. Lakini tango munda mfupi hivi Tunaona wazo inakatika, maji inakatika, mpaka tunashimba kisima ndani ya laga. Kwa hivyo hiyo shida, saidi ya natukabili saidi binadamu na hata wanyama ambao tunafuga. Na sisi, hatuna shamba kutosha, shamba yetu ni mfugo. Mfugo akipata shida, 